G'day guys, my name is Paul, welcome back to my channel. If you are your first time in this channel, please make sure don't forget to subscribe and press the notification bell so you will be notified with the next new video. And also if you like this video, please make sure you give a thumbs up at the end. And yeah, so today I'm going to re review uh, Purple Rice Yogurt. There's a many place in the Chinatown this day, like, uh, I'm going to review four of them which, and see which one is uh, the best one in this Chinatown city CBD. So let's get going, let's go! similar name it's a second the first competitor for the Yumi brand and after that not long after I got uh, the Yes yogurt opening up and, uh, and also after that I got the bread the very brand new one is the yogurt cow so I got here all the same which is the popularized yogurt their signature and so we're gonna try the original first which is the, the Yumi brand so let's try it So the first one is called Yumi and as you can see in here I got the purple rice which is like a sticky rice something like that and yeah it's kind of like a boba when you buy a milk tea so but this uh, frozen yogurt it comes with the purple rice so let's try it guys So the taste is very really refreshing. The yogurt itself is not that sour, so it actually is a bit milky and have a little bit of sweetness on it, so it's not a pure sour like the yogurt taste as you buy in the supermarket. The purple rice itself have a have a chewy taste texture on it. So when you eat like in between a sticky rice and a uh, there's normal rice, so in between. So the consistency is very good. And it blends together with the sweetness, the sourness of the yogurt, the milkiness of the milk, and the sugar. So I think they put sugar on this one. And combined together, it tastes perfect. So that's the, that's the first one. Let's try the competitor one, the second one, which is Kumi. Right. So Kumi, this is Kumi. As you can, I don't know if you can see properly, the kumi one is a bit like, the color is a bit uh, yellowish, kind of. And the, the, the purple rice is also the same. And hopefully the taste is better than the other one, shall we? Mm. Mm. So with the kumi one, the taste is a bit more sour than yummy so you can taste actually the frozen yogurt on it and they didn't think they're not gonna put too much sugar on this one but the purple rice is this one a bit more mushy so it's a bit more like um like overdone uh rice on it but i think and also the they didn't blend properly i think with the rice so it had the rice not really smooth but the taste itself similar as a normal yogurt with with milk and sugar on it. So, I thought this one a bit more sour than, than the other one. And I got also the competitor, which is the, uh, the second new one, which is the Yes Yogurt. So, hopefully, it's good. As you can see, guys, most of this brand have a similar a similar logo, look like just a different picture on it, but most compared to four of them, it's got kind of identical color identical model so it's hard to differentiate which one is from which store and until you taste it okay so the fourth the third one is a yes yogurt so the color 
it's the same as the Yumi, a bit lightish color, light yet uh, yellow color. So let's try. Mm. So this one, I can't really taste the yogurt that much. It's more a bit more milk than the other the compared to the other two. So this one a bit more milky kind of taste instead of the yogurt kind of taste. And the rice itself is still more chewy. It's kind of like not really well done kind of rice. So for the rice, I still prefer the first one. But taste wise, if you don't like too much flavor yogurt and you like a bit more milkier, then this is the one. But before that, Let's try the last one first, see if it's, it's more better or gonna be much the same. Let's try the last one. So this is the last one, which is the yogurt cow. As you can see, it's the consistency is a bit more thicker than the other one. It's kind of like a smoothie taste. So hopefully, like, not smoothie taste, but it's got like a smoothie texture on it. So, and uh, it's got more purple rice than the other one. Let's try guys, last one. Mm. Mm. So this one is a bit more kind of a bit more balanced. Better taste of the the milk, the yogurt, and the consistency of the the rice, the proper rice yogurt itself. It's good, it's well done cooked. But So this one a bit more, slightly more milk taste, but you still can taste the sourness of the yogurt. From all these four, I think for me personally, I still prefer Yumi. But for me, I don't really like that sour in my drink. But this one is, for me, it's perfect. You got the sweetness correct, the, the chewiness of the rice is correct, and also the taste of the milk itself. Not that, not that um, sour, not that sweet, just right. For if you are like tired, it's very hot weather in Sydney, by drinking this, man, it's gonna be so refreshing. So, so tell me in comment below, guys, which one of the frozen yogurt drink that you like the most? Is it Yumi, uh, Kumi, Yes Yogurt, or a Yogurt Cow? So all of this you can find in the uh, Chinatown area, in the alley. Kumi, I think, uh, opposite the market city. Kumi is on the other side, uh, just across the Golden Century in the Sussex Street. This two is in the Chinatown Alley, not that far. This one near the entrance of the alley, near the Emperor Restaurant. This one the, near the, I think, opposite Dixon House food court. So, that's all for today, guys. So, until next time, be safe, be happy, and see you later. Bye.